What's going on YouTube land? It is about a week since I posted on this channel. Now I've got some reasons for that and I needed to uh, post something here so I can update my audience uh, and what is going on. Now I don't know if I've mentioned it before in this channel but I actually maintain three YouTube channels and one of them just broke the requirements for YouTube monetization. Yay! Yeah, we were able to achieve the thousand subs and more than the 4,000 hours required. So now my biggest challenge is to develop this page and my other page that I'm working on. Now, maintaining three YouTube channels is a lot of work and behind the scenes not a lot of people actually get to see what I do uh, I am a filmmaker I'm a photographer and I'm also a producer and now I create YouTube videos the company that I work for is this channel and this channel we started posting videos about four months ago and we were able to uh, break the monetization just this week so yeah we've managed to get a fairly significant amount of subs uh, through our guests on this channel we we interview lots of different people from celebrities sports figures even ex-convicts law enforcement hip-hop stars so this has been a very interesting project on my end because not only i'm producing some of these segments i'm also shooting and at the same time i get to uh light up the set and be able to even compile some questions for the guests but i am not the one talking behind the mic but it's nice to be part of this whole production from start to finish i'm quite proud to what we have achieved in the last four months that we worked hard on this channel now in tandem with that i've been maintaining my own personal channel which is this one and it's mostly a lot of tech stuff and a lot of more information based uh, that revolves around photography and video so i'm assuming this channel is going to take another year or so for me to achieve some kind of monetization so if you're a newbie please you're more than welcome to sub and help support the channel and i'm hoping to uh create more content here now my most recent project that i uh started up again is another channel which is uh my own business is called focal finder now if uh if you have been following me focal final is the brand that i own and I have been working on this brand since 2011 when I was uh, finishing up on photography and film school. With this channel, I mean, look at these numbers from back then. Like eight years ago, you know, I was getting 41,000 views on these types of video. Now, I recently decided to restart this page again, more so to focus on subculture. I'm a big fan of, of creating stories and subculture. Now that I have a new camera, I can actually focus heavily on stories that I really like and one of them is the Latin community such as the Day of the Dead, the Low Riders, and I even dive into some more interesting stories from the vampire community to beard and mustache community you know sort of that nature so that's the kind of content you guys should expect down the road on this channel so please feel free to subscribe now the fourth thing I maintain out of my my own brand under focal finder is I work with agencies and different brands I create a lot of more commercial type esque um, for brands these are the videos that are more high gloss that I put in there and you probably see some of the music videos I've shot throughout the years but some of the bigger music videos I'm not allowed to post here where I've worked with big celebrities such as the Black Eyed Peas, uh, French Montana and all these other hip-hop stars but I'm not allowed to put it on my own personal Vimeo so you don't get to see a lot of that work here but yeah this is my other ways of creating content if I'm not around my regular YouTube page under this one. It's because I've been busy with the other platforms that I am um, building up and or I'm working with brands that need um, content to be shot. Now, the most recent project that I did was for the culture. I went out yesterday and I actually uh, started filming 
the lowrider community in Whittier. Surely enough, I was captured behind the scenes right here while I was filming some of the local participants in that event. It's quite nice that I was able to be uh, uh, photographed so I can actually see myself in action in that moment and to showcase to you where I go in these uh, subculture story hunts. This video, very much uh, a quick update on my end. I will hope to create more videos down the road and because now I have a new camera, I'm more driven to creating stories that are, are actually impactful to what I like to create, subcultures of that nature. And also let my audience know that I am still doing a lot of uh, tech stuff in between uh, and I'm hoping to share more of my camera experience in this channel. All right, I will close off this video for now. I will see you on the next one. Don't forget to smash that like button and subscribe. Thank you for watching. Peace.